Hi, this is Ben Preusich with Remax Above and Beyond, and welcome to your Real Estate Market Minute. Well, today I want to answer the question, are the surging foreclosure numbers going to tank our local real estate market? Um, and who's asking this question? Actually, investors. They are looking for foreclosures to purchase, uh, but there haven't been that many. Um, foreclosure numbers are really on the rise. If you look at the percentages, they're really shocking. From the uh, second to the third quarter of this year, foreclosures have increased by 30%. And if you look at third quarter this year compared to third quarter last year, they're up by over 60%. And the numbers are even worse here in Ohio. Uh, if you look at that same time frame. Uh, they're up 96% or almost a doubling of foreclosures. Now that sounds really bad and it's not great, but it's not as bad as it sounds because we're starting from a very low base of foreclosures. There haven't been many foreclosures for like the past 18 months. Why? Because of the pandemic and the government mandates basically prevented banks from foreclosing. Instead, they entered into forbearance agreements with the borrowers, where the borrowers were basically allowed to stay in their homes and not make any payments. Well, those forbearance agreements are ending now. Um, but a lot of these homes that are in foreclosure are never going to come to the market. And that's because the government is still incentivizing lenders to do modifications. So a lot of these um, borrowers that are in default are going to enter into like modification agreements with the lender that will allow them to stay in their home and start paying on their home again and eventually in some way catch up. That's called a modification agreement. The other thing though that's happening is the prices have been rising. So a lot of these folks that are in default, if they kept up on their maintenance, the house is worth quite a bit more than it was 18 months ago. So they're probably sitting on equity. So if they can't get a modification, they can probably just sell it normally on the open market. Um, so for these three reasons, really the uh, absolute numbers are kind of low. There's a lot of modifications happening and there's a lot of equity out there so um, the homeowners in trouble can simply sell they're not upside down i don't think we're going to have a crisis i think we're going to see some increased foreclosures on the market here and there but it's not going to be anything like 08 um, and it's going to be a market that just continues to chug along higher so that's your real estate market in a minute hope you enjoyed it. If you did, remember to like, share, and subscribe.